What is going on guys, it's Argon657 here. Today I bring you a Pokemon Gold Wi-Fi battle against Juke Duke. It's been a minute since I've uploaded anything because I haven't really been in the mood of uploading anything for a while. And then I've also been busy with working and all that stuff. So um, yeah, so he's going to lead off with Zapdos. Actually no, I'm going to lead off with Zapdos. He's going to lead off with Dragonite. He's going to switch out into his Blissey. Um, and I'm going to go for the Thunderbolt. I just want to see how much Thunderbolt will do. Uh, Thunderbolt doesn't do a whole lot, um, even with a crit. Um, obviously, Thunderbolt will probably do a lot less. So I don't want to stay in on Blissey because Blissey is a special wall. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go into my Skarmory to see what he's going to do. And I did expect him to go for a Toxic um, just in case, but he actually ends up going for a Light Screen. So... Um, so yeah, light screen's definitely gonna make um Thunderbolt do much less. So um he's gonna withdraw his Blissey and he's gonna go to his Dragonite and I'm gonna go for the roar again. And he's gonna be roared out into his Marowak and I'm gonna go for the Toxic so that way I could um put him on a timer. Um he's gonna end up going for the Rock Slide, and Rock Slide does pretty much nothing to my Skarmory. Um, which is good though because uh, now I know that I'll definitely gonna want to keep the Skarmory around as long as that Marowak's alive. So, um, so I have to keep that in mind. So yeah, he's gonna go into his Dragonite. I'm gonna go for the Dropek over here, and Dropek isn't gonna do too much to this Dragonite. Dragonite, um, natural bulk and all that stuff. So it's just not gonna do that much. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to switch out into my Tyranitar because uh, the only thing that I could probably take uh, a hit from him, he ends up going for the Thunder Wave, so that's not bad either. So I know that he's more of like a T-Wave set, uh, maybe support and all that stuff. So what I'm going to do is uh, I'm going to expect him to maybe want to switch out into uh, uh, maybe something I could take on Tyranitar, like maybe Scizor perhaps. So I don't know. Um, he's gonna go to this Machamp, and I'm gonna go for the Fire Blast. I actually expected him to maybe, perhaps, switch out to, like, a Steel-type or something like that. Um, but he ends up going into Machamp, so that's good. Fire Blast doesn't, uh, I mean, it does a decent amount, though, so, um, so yeah, I'm gonna end up going into my, um, Zapdos. I do want to keep my Skarmory healthy, so I just don't want to switch in, um, on this Machamp and all that stuff. So what... He's going to do is go for the curse. Uh, curse isn't going to do a lot. Um, it's just going to raise his attack and all that stuff. Uh, uh, so he's got plus one attack and plus one defense. But I'm going to go for the Thunderbolt. And he's going to end up going for the cross jump. And after plus one, um, it's going to do a decent amount to my Zapdos. Um, so I just kind of wonder if he has Rock Slide. He may have Rock Slide just to... Maybe perhaps uh, put me in KO range and all that stuff. So um, I'm going to go for the Thunderbolt. And I do get the Paralysis, thankfully. So he's going to go for the Rust, though, however. So all that damage is going to pretty much be recovered and all that stuff. And the thing is, in this generation, Sleep Talk is extremely broken. Because if you go for Sleep Talk and you're not at full HP and you go for Rest, you're going to regain all your health back. So it's just not going to make a difference. What happens? So I'm just hoping that um, that I uh, he doesn't get the rest or, or something like that. So I do get a critical hit, which is very very important. Um, it's gonna help me a lot. Obviously, it, it's very helpful because now I could probably take out this Machamp. Thankfully, he goes for cross jump with the sleep talk and not for rest, because that crit would have just not mattered at all. I would have just been wasting a thunderbolt. So he's going to end up switching out into his Blissey. And I'm going to go for the Thunderbolt again because I just want to finish off the uh, Machamp and all that. So, um, but yeah, it's going to do nothing to this Blissey. And uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to actually go into my, uh, I think, Skarmory. Yeah, I'm going to go to my Skarmory. He's going to end up going for the Heal Bell. Um... So he's gonna like, uh, he's basically gonna be, uh, uh, his Machamp's now fully awake. 
So now I'm just going to go for the Roar or something like that. Or I actually go for Toxic. Um, I'm going to go for the Toxic. He's going to go into his Dragonite. And thankfully I hit the Toxic. So now that I know this Dragonite is going to be... Uh, I'm going to have some more pressure put on uh, Dragonite. So... Um, but yeah, his Dragonite is probably the biggest threat on my team. So I do need to get rid of his, his Dragonite. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to stay in. And go for the drill pack. I want to see what he's going to do. So, um, I see that he has Reflect and Thunder Wave. So, um, I'm still a little afraid of the electric type move. Uh, Thunderbolt and all that stuff. Or Fire Blast even. I, um, going to stay in I think. Yeah, I'm going to stay in. And then he's going to go for the Thunder. Um, I just want to see, uh, I just want to scout out this Dragonite. And I probably should have, uh, just switched out or something like that that was a bad move on my part um but yeah i'm gonna go for the drill pack i just wanted to wear this dragonite down um but yeah uh dragonite yeah my bad my battery's low so i'm just gonna i'm gonna switch out into my uh tyranitar and he's gonna actually switch out his dragonite so He's gonna go to his Scizor. I figured he might have had like a Steel type, um, so I just wanted to, um, I just wanted to see what he was gonna do. But like, um, obviously he saw that I have Fire Blast, so now he's obviously gonna switch out um, to Starmie, and I'm going to, uh, I'm just gonna, um, yeah, sorry about that. Uh, I'm just gonna switch out though because I really don't have anything to do. Although I think I might stay in. I think I'm staying in. So he's gonna end up going for the surf over here. I really don't have a lot of switch ins to this Starmie. Um, now that Zapdos has been weakened and all that stuff. So I'm gonna go for the Rock Slide. And unfortunately for me, I miss. So that means that I'm gonna have to just uh, settle with the. Um, um, you know, I'm just gonna have to. Uh, Find somebody to be Death Fodder. I do have Kingdra though. Um, I could switch into Kingdra, but I decided to stay in again. Let's see what he's gonna do. Um, but yeah, unfortunately, uh, Surf is going to take me out. I definitely should have switched out into Kingdra, but I didn't really have a whole lot to do against Starmie. So, um, but what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go f to my uh, Heracross. Um, I just don't know, uh, I'm pretty sure he has Psychic or something like that. Um, he is gonna go for Psychic. I think I should be able to live one, because, um, I don't know, this, obviously Psychic, i kind of surprised I took it a little bit better. Um, but it's gonna do around half, and then I'm gonna go for the Mega Horn, and, uh, I do take out the Starmie, so that's really nice. So, that's one threat out of the way. So, I do have to get rid of the Dragonite. In order to be more comfortable. Because my Tyranitar is gone. Um, so he's going to go into uh, Scizor over here. And um, obviously my Zapdos is probably the best thing that I could go into. Um, so I'm just going to switch out. I'm going to go to my Skarmory. And uh, he's going to go for the Agility. And actually I seen the Agility. I had a feeling he was going to Baton Bass into his Marowak. So I'm going to go for the Roar predicting that. So, obviously, he's going to go for the sword stance, um, and then I'm just going to go for the roar just to keep him from setting up on me again. So, it's really nice, though, because now I don't have to worry about getting swept by Scizor or the Marowak if he decides to go for the baton pass. Because seeing agility, um, uh, swords dance, and all that stuff, I'm thinking he, maybe he has baton pass. But he's going to go to his Machamp, and he's going to go for the rest, which sucks. And I get fully paralyzed, so that sucks. Um, I probably should go for the rest or something like that. Uh, but he's going to withdraw his Machamp. And uh, I'm going to go uh, for the Roar. Um, I do get... Uh, I just want to phase his team and all that stuff. Just phase it a bit. Um, I probably should be going for rest, but like I don't want him uh, using... Using my uh, Skarmory as setup fodder and all that stuff. So he's going to go uh, into his Blissey. And obviously I probably... Uh, yeah, that Drill Pack is actually going to do a decent amount. Um, uh, I really should be going for rest. 
Uh, I don't know why I'm not going for rest, but I'm actually going to go for the Toxic. So he's going to go for the Heal Bell. And uh, I'm going to go for the Toxic over here. Just get the Poison. Because um, uh, I just want to probably force it to go for Heal Bell and all that stuff. He still has the Marowak. He still has the Scizor. Um, he's going to go for the Soft Boiled. I actually predicted him to switch. Um, so... Because I went for Toxic again, expecting him to possibly switch out. Um, but yeah, that sucks. Because uh, I'm not able to uh, just... He just stays in and all that stuff. And I probably... I, I Honestly, I feel like I should be just going for rest. But I, I just don't want him using me instead of fodder again. So uh, I'm just going to just stay in and go for Dropek. And uh, I'm going to go for... Uh, it's not going to do a whole lot. To Dragonite, uh, I know that uh, you know we'll see. Uh, I know that like he has Thunder now, so I I don't really have I don't have all good switching right now, so I'm just gonna have to uh, just see what he's gonna do. So he's gonna have Fire Blast, so he's gonna have obviously that's for Scizor and all that stuff, and Thunder's for Skarmory. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna go to my Kingdra, and I can take. Any hit from him, like I'm just gonna go for the ice beam, and uh, I do outspeed him thankfully. And then uh, I was actually gonna go for surf, but I then I decided, you know what, I'm just gonna go for ice beam. And luckily, I'm able to take out this Dragonite. So now there's two threats out of the way. So Dragonite and uh, Starmie are both gone. So now my team can sort of relax a bit. So, but his Machamp is still a big threat. So I have to. That's another Pokemon that I'm gonna have to deal with. Um, I'm just gonna have to, uh, just hope, uh, hope for the best. Um, but yeah, my Zapdos could, can't really wall this, uh, Machamp if he starts, like, cursing up and all that stuff, so he's gonna have pl that plus one attack and all that stuff, so I'm just gonna, um, just go for Thunderbolt, just try to get as much damage as I can. Um, I am faster than him, so, and the thing is, if he goes for rest and all that stuff, um, that's fine. Um, but he's gonna go for cross chop. It's not gonna do a whole lot. Um, and Thunderbolt is a three hit KO, so that's good. I could force him to go for rest and all that stuff. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna go for the Thunderbolt. And I'm gonna, uh, just... Hopefully, uh, he doesn't go for rest. And thankfully he doesn't. Um, he does take out my Zapdos, unfortunately, so... Uh, that means he's probably gonna have a chance to go into his, uh, he's probably gonna have a chance to go for the rest, so, uh, we'll see. Um, I'm gonna go for the Thunderbolt here because I really need to get, the, get as much damage, and I actually realized my, um, my Machamp actually, uh, not, not my Machamp, my Gengar actually walls this Machamp, so, um, so yeah, Gengar actually is one of the, Pokemon that I could deal with Machamp, so, um, but yeah, um, uh, I do have, uh, I think I have Fire Punch, but I don't want to reveal to him, so I'm just gonna go for the Thunderbolt, I'm gonna switch out, um, into my Skarmory, I believe, uh, I just wanna, like, make sure that he, um, You know, see what he's gonna do. I just don't want him setting up on me. I don't want him going for roar, not roar, uh, swords, dance, agility. So I have to um, just try to put as much pressure on him. So he's gonna actually switch out. Um, he's gonna go to his blissey, and he's gonna get hurt by the poison and all that stuff. So that's fine. Um, I'm gonna go for the. Uh, I think. Yeah, these leftovers, I'm just gonna probably go for the, um, rest, I believe, or drill pack. No, I'm gonna go for drill pack. He's gonna go for the heal bell, it's gonna heal his Pokemon and all that stuff, his Machamp and all that. And I'm fully paralyzed, so, that's when I realized, you know, I, I, I should be going for rest and all that stuff, so, um, but yeah, I'm just gonna continue going for the, uh, drill pack. Uh, cause at this point, like, my Skarmory's almost at full health. There's really no reason for it to not go for rest. And, uh, no reason to go for rest, though, if I'm almost at full health. But I could just get rid of the, uh, Paralysis. Um. 
and all that stuff. So I'm just gonna stay and go for Joe Peck. Um, but yeah, like just getting paralyzed is just really uh, it's definitely gonna hurt my Skarmory. So I'm just gonna go for the Joe Peck here, and um, it's not gonna do a whole lot. Um, I just want to make sure that that he has a timer and all that stuff. So I'm just gonna go for Toxic. He's gonna go for the Rock Slide, so obviously the Para Flinch is there, so... Um, as long as I don't flinch, which unfortunately I do, but... I'm gonna go for the Roar, and uh, he's gonna end up going for the Rock Slide again, and um... I'm gonna go for the Roar, because I wanna... I just don't... I wanna see what he... Uh, I just wanna phase out his team and all that stuff, but the thing is because... His team isn't really toxic, I'm just shuffling around his team. Um, so yeah, now I finally go for rest. Um, he's gonna withdraw his Blissey, and he's gonna go to his Marowak, and I'm gonna go for the rest, finally. Um, just to get that health back, because I was kind of, uh, getting tired of the paralysis and all that stuff, so. Um, I'm just gonna, you know, just drill pack and all that stuff. Um. But obviously, he's going to go for the sword stance, and this is looking pretty bad. Um, I'm going to be fast asleep, and uh, he's going to go for the rock slide. And it's probably going to do... Um, it's probably going to do a good amount. It's actually just... It's going to do just under half, so that's good. Um, but I'm actually, after seeing that, I'm just going to uh, switch out and probably sack something. I'm going to go to my, um, my Heracross has Death Fodder, so I don't really have a whole lot to switch into. And my Heracross doesn't, isn't really that useful anymore, so uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to my uh, Kingdra, and I'm going to go for the Surf, because uh, I... Also realize I'm I'm also gonna need that uh, I'm also gonna need to uh, get rid of that Blissey and all that stuff because I got rid of my uh, my Heracross so I mean I sacked my Heracross I probably should have uh, shouldn't have done that now that I'm thinking about it because now his Bliss is gonna become more and more of a threat uh, because I don't really have a lot of physical attacking Pokemon I have Skarmory left and I have Gengar with Explosion. Um, but yeah, uh, it's just becoming uh, a bigger threat now because now he's going to have light screen and I'm going to end up having to uh, just... I'm going to have to try and deal as much damage as I can. So the the best thing I could do potentially is just stall out his um, PP and all that stuff. And uh, he's going to switch out... Uh, He's going to end up switching to a Scizor. I'm going to go for the Drill Pack over here. Thankfully, I wake up. I figured I was going to wake up after two turns because rest only lasts for two turns sleeps. Um, but yeah, I'm going to just keep on going for Drill Pack. Uh, I just need to take out his Scizor. Um, his Scizor uh, is basically uh, those Pokemon that could probably just Baton Pass over to um, Marowak or something like that. He's going to go for the agility, so that's fine. Um, but there isn't, there isn't really much he could do. Um, I'm just going to... I do get a crit, though, so that's good with the drill pack. And then I'm going to go for the roar. He's going to go for the steel wing, and it's not going to do a whole lot uh, to my Skarmory. I went for roar just in case it goes for, like, a uh, baton pass. Um, and he's going to go to his Machamp, so that's good. Um... So yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, um, I'm gonna go for the drill pack over here, and I think because, uh, since I, uh, since I recovered from the paralysis, uh, I should be able to, uh, you know, be faster than him, and I'm gonna go for the drill pack, and take out his scissor, um, he's gonna go to his Marowak over here, so it's actually looking pretty good for me, because now... I was getting rid of his threats and all that stuff, so... I'm gonna go for the Roar. Um... I don't want him setting up Sword Stance and all that stuff, so I'm just gonna, um... Just, uh... Yeah, he goes for Sword Stance, I do predict that. I'm gonna go for the Roar. Um... 
He's gonna end up going to his Blissey and all that stuff, so that's fine. Um so I'm just gonna go for Toxic. Um because uh, you know, there really isn't because he has Machamp, he has Blissey, and he has Marowak left. The thing is after I take out Marowak and all that stuff, uh it'll be a lot easier. Um I'm just gonna go for the drill peck over here because at this point, he has to deal as much damage as possible on me. And, um, you know, um, I'm gonna, uh, end up going for the drill pack again, and I should be able to knock him out. Um, I'm just gonna go for the drill pack. I'm gonna, um, I should be able to knock him out. And actually, the poison will if I don't, so the poison should knock him out. Um,. It doesn't, but either way, uh, I could just go for the rest if I wanted to, but I'm just gonna stay in and go for Joe Peck just to finish him off. Um, so now he just has two Pokemon left. He has the, uh, Machamp. My Gengar walls Machamp. And, um, and I could just go for the Joe Peck and I could just finish off the, uh, uh, Machamp and all that stuff. Uh, he, he... His Machamp is gone, so I think his last Pokemon is going to be Blissey. And I do have the Gengar, and actually turns out he has nothing against my Gengar. So, But I have Explosion, so it didn't really matter. Um, I think he's going to... Uh, yeah, I'm just going to switch out into my Gengar just to go for the Explosion. He's going to go for the present, and uh, he's actually going to, I believe, forfeit. Um... So, I think he's going to for, Yeah, he's going to forfeit, giving me the victory. So, that was a good battle. Uh, so, uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, if you guys enjoyed it, be sure to leave a comment below. Leave a like and subscribe to my channel. And I will see you guys later.